these students will be in hot demand once they leave Polytech. With the Christchurch rebuild and plans for more housing in Auckland, the shortage of skilled tradesmen is already happening now. In an attempt to draw more people into careers such as carpentry, electrical and mechanical engineering, the Otago Polytech has announced it will waive the tuition fees for up to one year. We've decided we should do our part for our own community by offering a free tuition free approach. It's only for the trades areas and it's to help overcome the long term skill shortage that is happening actually now and will happen into the future. Woodell says he hopes it's a trigger for young people on the unemployment benefit who may have liked to have done a trades course but felt they couldn't afford it. In a way we're trying to make sure that we don't have too much drift leaving the city where we're in fact lacking trades people. There's enough places for another 200 students and the first intake is in mid-July and Waddell believes the versatile qualifications can set students up for life. I think it's, uh, trades are often underrated and understated. They can take you all over the world. They can give you very, very satisfying reward, you know, careers. So it gives you a reward. I mean, look, I did a fitting and turning apprenticeship a long time ago. That's allowed me to travel the world. It's allowed me to get into different parts of careers, all because I did um, a trade. So it gives you a fantastic base. And I have to say, it actually, at the moment, is giving you not a bad income as well. The incentive applies to programs in carpentry, plasterboard stopping, painting, masonry trades, automotive, electrical and mechanical engineering. D. Karen, 39 Dunedin News.